You're watching Skylands, the local bird's eye view. My name is Bart, and I'll be your host and pilot in command for this mission. Folks, today we're going to continue our journey on the 287 and visit the township of Booton. So sit back, relax, kick your feet up, and enjoy the show. For those of you interested in the contest, there's a new hint at the end of the episode, so see you there! you on location from Grace Lord Park. Currently called Booton, this quirky town owes its name to Thomas Boone colonial governor in the 1700s. Boone Town was established around the ironworks industry and grew under a man named Obadiah Baldwin. During the American Revolutionary War, the Boonton Ironworks produced iron for the military. Later, with the construction of the Morris Canal, the New Jersey Iron Company was formed and the town grew. Speaking of wars, Boonton citizens proudly served in World War II. During World War II, people flew a flag with a blue star in their front window, so everyone in town knew that a family member was serving in the military. If the star was gold, however, it indicated that a soldier had fallen in the line of duty. to the Booton Reservoir. During the 18th century, this area was called Boontown Falls and the center of town was around where the reservoir sits today. In 1908, John Leal, with the help of George Fuller, constructed a chlorination plant at Booton Reservoir, which became the first of its kind in the nation. Around the same time, Booton's Londa Hard Rubber Company became famous for producing a type of early plastic used in kitchens worldwide. This is also the site of the original Booton, which was flooded to create Booton Reservoir. This reservoir provides drinking water to the residents of Jersey City, New Jersey. Did you know that Grace Lord Park sits on Booton Gorge? A gorge is defined as a valley between two hills or mountains, typically with a river running through it or a stream, just like you see down there. I guess you can't go there. Created in 1829, the Morris Canal was used to transport coal to the ironworks and then products to markets. The Morris Canal was a complex series of locks and plains that allowed water and boats to connect industry to markets and harbors. After just under 100 years of service, the railroad came and the Morris Canal was mostly broken apart. Team Skylines heading out from the gorge. 
where we're gonna go check out the railroad museum that's right across the street from here. See you there. We're at the Lackawanna Railhouse across the street from um, Grace Lord Park. Well, the, the kind of like the end of Grace Lord Park, the other side of the trail. I'm at the United Railroad Historical Society of New Jersey. They are a not-for-profit organization that seeks to educate and preserve the railroads and rail cars from this area. Let's take a look from the air. The Booten Branch was a railroad built in 1870 and ran 34 miles from Hoboken to East Dover Junction. The railroad passed through Lyndhurst, Passaic, Clifton, Patterson, Wayne, Lincoln Park, Mountain Lakes, and its namesake, Booten. Originally formed as a freight line carrying materials, the rail line is currently run by New Jersey Transit and has been serving commuters and travelers alike ever since. For those of you following the contest, here's a brand new hint. Thanks for watching. If you enjoy this episode, hit the like button, support us by hitting subscribe, and until next time, Pilot in Command signing off.